Hi, I'm Kylie with Safe Kids, and today I'll be talking to you about choking and strangulation prevention in your home. The majority of non-fatal choking incidents are food related, so make sure that you're cutting up your children's food into small pieces. The most common types of foods that kids choke on are hot dogs, cheese sticks, hard candies, nuts, grapes, marshmallows, and popcorn. Children are more at risk for choking while lying down or playing, so it's best to place them in a high chair or at the table and to always supervise them while eating. It's important to see the world from a child's point of view. Get low so that you are at a child's eye level and look for items that could be a choking hazard. Common items include buttons, jewelry, magnets, marbles, coins, button batteries, or toys with missing or broken pieces. Keep cords and strings, including those attached to window blinds, out of your child's reach. You can use cord windups to keep them up and away. Move all cribs, beds, furniture, and toys away from windows and window cords. When it comes to sleeping, babies should be placed alone, on their backs, in a crib with a firm mattress, and the crib should not have any stuffed animals, blankets, or other accessories. The slats of the crib should be close enough together that you can't fit a can of soda in between them. If they're too far apart, your child could get stuck. Also, make sure that you're not tying any ribbons or strings to your child's pacifier or crib. For more tips on keeping your children safe at home, visit safekidslincoln.org.